There are parents now bringing in their kids for shoes for track and cross country that came here as customers when they were in track and cross country. They continue to be a part of, of us and we're a part of them. It's, it's, it uh, makes you feel good to know people, that you're helping people. You know, I, I'm not smart enough to be a physician or, or something like that, but over the years we've, we've uh, there's been numerous cases where I've been able to help people get back on their feet, uh, so to speak. <laughs> play on words, I guess. We want to support runners and fitness and ha a healthy lifestyle in as many ways as we can. You know, we help help put on events. Well, I think those events are good for the community. They keep get people out on the road. Uh, people are in better shape as a result of it. Um, but it's also good for our business. Business-wise, we've, you know, we're a, a local, independently owned business and we've we've always believed in supporting the community and, and supporting local as much as possible. One thing I, I think I always have had is a self-confidence that I can do something. Um, <clears throat> and I think that came home to me more because of other family members who didn't have that self-confidence. Um, but I was pretty sure it would work and uh, and that I could work hard enough to make it work. And uh, um, especially, I think, when a couple of people say, oh, no, no, this won't, this won't work, you can't do it. You know, that just drove me harder, I think. We've been successful, we found our niche, and, and, and uh, you know, I try to give back to the community. I think there's, that's an important part, um, that you play, you've been semi-successful, then you need to give something back. I'm just very humbled to be recognized for this. I look around at how many people have been involved with Grandview, over the years and how many deserving people there are and I'm, I'm blown away.